Okay, guys, uh, greetings to you wherever you are. We are still talking about what is going on. What is trending in Nigerian politics? You have heard that from uh, uh, Daniel Bwala. I will still allow you guys to listen to what Daniel Bwala said. Uh, for those of us that have forgotten, or uh, those of us that have not uh, heard about or seen the video before. All right, so the latest update I have for you is that Atiku has broken silence because uh, many people has been talking about uh, this Daniel Bwala, uh, you know, body language, uh, dining and whining with uh, Tinibu's administration. Even when he was talking against Tinibu's policy some time ago, even in 2002, we all remember how Daniel Bwala uh, criticizes the APC government, but uh, Daniel Bwala now is the one uh, that are praising the administration. You have heard that from him. So just like I told you guys, uh, Tiko has broken silence because many people has been crediting uh, Daniel Bwala's action. You understand that Tiko or Daniel Bwala has finally abandoned Atiku Abubakar, that he was his aide. Of course, we know that Daniel Bwala is, uh, was the ally of Atiku Abubakar, but I think not anymore. So Atiku Abubakar has clarified that Daniel Bwala only served as a spokesperson for his presidential campaign from 2022 to early 2023. And now uh, that takes us back to what I've been talking about politics. If you think that these politicians um, care about you uh, as their fans, then you must um, you know think twice or you must need a brain reset your brain need to go back to factory uh, reset uh, these politicians do not care about you they do not care about you they are fans they do not care about you or whatsoever they care about themselves you understand that is the truth we have all seen the likes of uh, Femi Fani Kayode we have all seen the likes of um, uh, Reno Mokri you understand uh, before now, he was uh, criticizing the administration, but now Reno Mercury is on the side of Bola Metinibu. And then Daniel Bola here is not left out. You understand? So Atiku Abubakar says Daniel Bola didn't save him personally in any capacity, admonishing the media on or uh, to stop referring to him as his aide. So this is as, um, as Atiku dissociated himself from Daniel Bwala, who formerly served as a spokesperson for his uh, campaign in the last year's uh, presidential election. So Atiku made the clarification in a statement uh, that was yesterday, or uh, Tuesday, yeah, uh, by his media office. He clarified that uh, Bwala only served as a spokesperson for his presidential campaign from 2022 to 2023, adding that his relationship with him was restricted to his role. And then the, um, Bwala was not and has never been his aid beyond his specific role. So according to Atiku Abubakar from his office, in quote, they said, it is important that the media and the general public take corrective note of defining Mr. Daniel Bwala as an aid to His Excellency Atiku Abubakar. Bola offered his service and support to Atiku Anokowa Presidential Campaign Organization as a spokesperson and was in a position he held, and it was a position he held during the last presidential campaign. All right, so that was the statement. All right, so just like I told you guys, uh, you've heard from Daniel Bola uh, that he's committed to... Um, uh, Tinibu, you understand Tinibu's administration and so on. So that makes us to understand the body language of all these politicians. That is it. So it is obvious that we see people who, you know, kill themselves, you know, quarrel within themselves just because of politicians. Politics or political party do not change a man. It is only a man that changes political party. Of course, I understand that in Nigeria, we practice partisan politics. But yet, we shouldn't allow these people who call themselves politicians to push us into, made us what we are not, just because of their political party um, 
affiliation. You understand? Because I, I see I, I see no reason why a man will serve in PDP and you worship him. Uh, the same person will go to APC tomorrow and you worship him or worship the political party. No. Daniel Bola now serving Tinebu. All those things that he had said about APC, he, he do not really care about what you think about them as long as he's benefiting from the system. So I quickly want to update you that Atiku has uh, dissociated himself from uh, Daniel Bwala, that he only serve as a spokesperson as Atiku and Atiku uh, Okowa presidential campaign, that he was not his aide in any way. But however, let me know what you guys think after watching what Daniel Bwala said the moment or after he visited Tinibu in Aso Rock, few days after talking about um, Atiku's interest in 2027 presidential election. This is not about political party. And you need to know that, like I said, I was with him before I left. And I was doggedly committed to him. I told him today, I am committing to play my part to support your administration. And I have no apologies to anybody. You are back in ABC? I have no apologies. ABC is a party. President Bola Mechilibu is my motivation. If supporting him will take me to ABC, so be it. Ah, congratulations. <laughs>